Hello, this is the Healthy Guy Reviews channel, and today we are going to talk about apple cider vinegar, a food known since antiquity, widely used in cooking and also as a medicine for many health issues. Apple cider vinegar, or ACV, is a type of vinegar made from fermented apple juice. Like other types of cider vinegar and wine vinegar, it has between 5% and 6% acidity. This vinegar does not need refrigeration and has a very long shelf life, and can be consumed even when it changes color, looking more cloudy, which is a natural process. Some marks may have a darker layer floating on top of the surface. This layer is formed by enzymes during the fermentation process and is called mother. It can be consumed without any problem. Apple cider vinegar contains a negligible amount of calories, almost no fat, carbohydrates or protein, and it also contains no fiber. In addition to liquid form, apple cider vinegar can be found in pills, capsules, and chewing gum. Note that ACV supplements may not be as potent as the liquid form, and will likely cost more. ACV is rich in antioxidant polyphenols and probiotics, which may be beneficial for digestion and gut microbiome health. Now let's see some benefits that apple cider vinegar can bring. Number 1. ACV and Weight Loss While more research is needed, it is already known that ACV can promote weight loss by suppressing appetite when consumed with a meal. A study with two groups of people demonstrated that the group that used ACV doubled the weight loss compared to the group of people that did not consume it. However, a recent review concluded that there is not enough data to claim that ACV is really effective as a weight loss aid. Therefore, this question remains without a definitive answer. Number 2. ACV and High Cholesterol Some studies suggest that ACV consumption, when consumed daily, can actually be effective in controlling cholesterol, as it improves digestion. But the intensity of the benefit and the recommended dose are still under review. Number 3. ACV and Type 2 Diabetes Apple cider vinegar may be beneficial in controlling blood sugar levels, especially in people with insulin resistance. When taken before a high-carbohydrate meal, ACV slows the rate at which the stomach empties, which prevents large spikes in blood sugar. At the same time, it helps the body move more glucose out of the bloodstream and into cells. Interestingly, just a small amount of apple cider vinegar is enough to cause this effect. For this it should be consumed before meals, diluted in a little water. While some studies suggest that ACV can help lower blood glucose, others say this is not true. Therefore, more research is needed to reach a consensus on the topic. Number 4. ACV and Ulcerative Colitis Although ACV improves digestion, there is still a lack of evidence to prove its benefit in the treatment of autoimmune diseases, such as ulcerative colitis. An animal study has shown that the use of ACV can decrease colon inflammation and increase the amount of beneficial bacteria in the gut, but this is still far from being a treatment recommendation. Number 5. ACV and Inflammation some people suggest taking apple cider vinegar as a treatment to manage symptoms in inflammatory conditions such as rheumatoid arthritis, RA, multiple sclerosis, MS, and ankylosing spondylitis, AS. One explanation is that vinegar can reduce inflammation and lessen symptoms. However, there are no studies directly exploring ACV as a therapy for RA, MS, or AS. Talk to your doctor if you have one of these conditions before trying ACV. Number 6. ACV and Skin Conditions Using ACV on the skin may have some benefit, but it is important to use it in a diluted form, otherwise it may cause burns. In the case of eczema, applying ACV can be beneficial in helping to restore the skin's natural pH. It so happens that a study regarding this possibility did not present relevant results, in addition to having registered several cases of irritation at the site where the ACV was applied. In the case of psoriasis on the scalp, ACV can help to lessen the itchiness, but it should always be used in a diluted form to avoid burning. Number 7. ACV and Polycystic Ovarian Syndrome PCOS. Polycystic Ovarian Syndrome is a hormonal disorder associated with irregular menstrual cycles, 
high levels of androgen hormones, ovarian cysts, and insulin resistance. One study showed that women who consumed ACV diluted in water right after dinner had better hormone levels and more regular menstrual cycles. While more research is needed, a tablespoon of ACV a day appears to be a really effective dose for PCOS. As seen, ACV has the potential to benefit the body in a number of situations, but there is still a lack of research to prove its full potential. Meanwhile, its consumption should be done in moderation, as excessive amounts can reduce the level of potassium in the body too much, which is dangerous. There are hundreds of ACV options on the market. We selected three brands of ACV capsules, three brands of gummies, and one brand of liquid ACV. They are among the best sellers and best rated by Amazon customers. The links are in the description of this video. ACV can interact with certain medications, such as laxatives, diuretics, certain diabetes, and heart disease medications. That's why it's very important to talk to your doctor before incorporating ACV into your daily diet. The biggest risks in excessive consumption of ACV, in addition to the decrease in potassium, are erosion of tooth enamel, esophageal burns, gastrointestinal discomfort, acid reflux and worsening kidney disease. A couple of spoonfuls before each meal will not do any harm. I hope you enjoyed this video and that it was helpful in your quest for a healthier life. Thank you for your time and attention, and until the next video.